Before we get into the video, I want to give a big shout out to today's sponsor, ExitLag. ExitLag is a program that helps reduce lag and optimizes your internet connection so that you can play at your best in games like World of Warcraft and Final Fantasy XIV. It also has a really cool feature called the FPS Boost. This optimizes your computer to actually increase FPS in your games. And there's currently a free 3 day trial, so if you do want to give ExitLag a go, now is a great time to do so. I put the link in the description down below, so yeah, just give that a click, try out the trial. It's been a while since I've done this. It's been like, what, two, three weeks since, well, it's been about two weeks, I think, since I logged into this character the last time. I think it's been about two weeks since I streamed last as well, actually. But, um, yeah, I thought I'd do a bit of Iron Man Challenge today before I start my leveling, which I'll be try I'm trying to grind to 60. It's not going very well for me. It's not going very well for me. Um, I'm level 26. <laughs> Basically, I keep getting very distracted. And we've worked on top. Leveling's not going very well for me. Leveling's not going very well for me. Um, so yeah, I need to I need to get into it. I really do. The thing is with me is that I want to play every class, right? I want to play every class. I love every class pretty much. Not the same, but each class in this game I love for a different reason. Like mage, I love just destroying things as a mage. Like polymorph, pyroblast, pyroblast, boom, everything. You know, the target's dead. That I find really fun. And they got AoE grinding too. And Paladin, I love the the aesthetic and the um, the whole like you know two hundred mace um, holy warrior type thing. I think that was really badass. And then uh, druid, I just like druids. I think druids are cool. I love the whole nature and t turning into um, animals and shit. That's cool. And then what else am I enjoying? Hunter, Hunter's is cool because they're just a fun class. I like really that kind of RPG aspect to a Hunter where you know, you're, you got to feed your pet, you got your arrows, you got to teach your pet different abilities and then you can dual wield and have an arrow, a bow and arrow as well. I just think the RPG as like aspect of Hunter's is really cool. And if you have like cooking and leatherworking and skinning, you literally feel like an adventurer, you know, going out in the world, camping out. Hunters literally have that kind of like, for me, Hunters just make so much sense in like an RPG kind of style. Because you're, 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 well, you're a hunter. Hunters exist in real life. But you're going out, you got your, your weapons, you got your bone arrow, you got your pet. You're skinning, you're level working. You I just genuinely feel like immersed as a hunter. So yeah, that's the reason why, other than the fact that because of work and that I get easily distracted, why I'm very low level. Currently Hello. on my main character, because I'm around. my Druid's level 24, <laughs> my Mage 26, and my Hunter's 22, and I have 15 Paladin. I need to stop. Um, I need to focus on one character, essentially. That's what I need to do. Wait, what am I doing? I don't even, I don't even know what quest I'm doing. Princess must die. Too low for that. Lost necklace. Just do that one. Go speak to Billy McClure. But yeah, so I'm uh, partially. I'm just. I don't know what class I want to play. I don't know what class I want to play. I. I keep swapping what I want to play, which is why they're all like the same level, pretty much, other than my Paladin, which is level 15. I'm really struggling on choosing what class I want to play, just because I like them all. I like them all. I like them all for several different reasons. So that's, that's an issue I'm having right now. Because all my friends are level 60, they've all cleared Mountain Core, they've all done it next year. My brother's level 40 or something. So I'm there literally just lagging behind. I am the same level now as I was day two or day three when the, the expansion released pretty much. It's, uh, yeah, it's pretty bad. Ooh, bring four chunks of boar meat to Auntie Bernice. Stay in the forest, killing boars. Live to win, till you die. Oh, no, I think it was. I think they used Team Speak at you know, Holy shit, I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm doing Iron Man Challenge. I completely forgot I was doing Iron Man Challenge. Shit. Um. Just don't kill me. Oh, fuck. fuck, fuck. Oh, shit. Is this, is this the game over for me? No, I'm, I'm okay. I can live. I'm alright. Oof. By the way, this new Coke drink, this energy Coca Cola drink, is the worst thing ever. If you ever see it in a shop, do not buy it. It tastes like piss. Well, no, I think it piss tastes better. This tastes awful. So uh, yeah, when I was walking my dog this morning, 
I remembered a thing that happened to me at the start of World of Draenor, where I accidentally destroyed a guild without knowing anything, about, without even knowing that I was destroying a guild, right? So, I when, when World of Draenor came out, if you remember rightly, the, it was, the launch was awful, you couldn't get into it, you, were, you couldn't get into your character, um, most of the services didn't work, you were stuck in your garrison forever. So I played, I played on Outland EU, which is like the biggest, I think, one of the biggest uh, EU servers. I think Argent Dawn's bigger. But basically, I couldn't log in for the first week. So I had the realm transfer to like a low pop realm. So I, tra I transferred my druid over. My druid's a female druid, well, at least it was at the time. And because I didn't want to use, you know, banana raccoon or banana or anything on this new server, because I, I planned on leaving as soon as, as soon as it kind of calmed down, I planned on going back to Outland anyway. So I made this. Female, I, I transferred my female druid and I called it Ayari. Not, you know, not really thinking much of it. And then when I was leveling up, some guy invited me to the guild, his guild. And he was like, oh, are you not in a guild? Do you want to join us? We can do some five mans and do some raids and stuff. I was like, yeah, I mean, that's cool. I need to get some gear before I PvP anyway, so I might as, I might as well join, join up before I transfer back to Outland. But it was really weird. His guild was really strange because they were, they were really, really nice, which I thought was really nice, I thought it was really cool. Obviously, I, was, I thought, oh, I'm the new guy, they're being nice to me, they help me out, yeah, this is a really cool guild. Um, they got really weird really quick, right? So, remember, I'm a female druid called Ayari. They all, I found out later on, I didn't find out this for a while, that they thought I was a girl, right? So they were all flirting with me, I thought it was just them being, you know, a bit of bants, Whatever. So I was, pl I was playing along like, yeah, 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 whatever, yeah, 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 cool, cool. And then it got really weird that they were starting to like, ask me for pictures and stuff. I was like, this is really strange. But what I didn't realise at the same time was that behind the scenes, all these guys in this guild were fighting over Ayara or Ayari because they thought I was a girl who played World of Warcraft. Which is fucking hilarious. So... I, I, to be honest, they were really cool. Well, I mean, they weren't cool because they, obviously they were trying to fuck me, apparently. <laughs> but they gave me loads of gold. They gave me pets and stuff, and they ran me through dungeons. Because I'm a feral druid, and feral druids have always been pretty bad in, in dungeons, right? So they kind of, like, took me through them. So I got some nice gear. And then they invited me to a cool... Because I hadn't been on voice cons with them before. Because I, I don't really... Uh, I don't know, I don't like... Um, I have to get to know someone really well before I start going on voice cons with them. So they asked me to go on voice cons. I was like, yeah, okay, fine, fair enough. I've known you guys for a couple weeks now. I might as well. Um, and then they realised I was a guy. Turns out the reason they got me into, a, into the call with them is because they wanted me to uh, choose which guy that I liked the most. <laughs> so... I was a bit like, huh, okay, oh shit, am I going to die again? Not again, but like, almost die again. Uh, go away, fuck off. No, do I have any health potions? I don't, shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I think I'm okay, I think I'm okay. Oh, she tucky mushrooms. So where was I? Um, oh god, I can still... No, I should be okay, I think. I keep forgetting I'm doing the Iron Man challenge, so I just keep going in as, as I would normally. I'm not really thinking about it. Um, so yeah, it was oh yeah, yeah, they dragged me to this cool to, for me to choose who, which one of them I like the best. So they, when they realised that obviously my voice, I'm a guy, they were like, yo, you've been, you've been playing us, all this kind of stuff. I was like, well, not really. I didn't know you thought I was a girl <laughs> until about five minutes ago. So basically... Because, of the, because they were fighting amongst themselves, like, apparently ruthlessly as well. Um, they decided to break up, and this guild had been together for years, apparently. So, I'm here, just chilling, just trying to, you know, get some gear, just chilling, having some fun playing Walls of Drown, because it was good at the start of the game. When when what came out, it was a good expansion. Like, it, was a good, it was fun at the start. And little did I know, there's like 10 guys were trying to screw me because they thought I was a chick. And then, 
because they all wanted to do this do me <laughs> they were fighting about it which is is crazy I'm not I'm not telling the story the best like I, I wish I'd written it out and gone over everything but yeah so they were fighting over me because they thought I was a girl and then because I'd caught well, I, I say I had caused I wasn't aware of it but because of all the damage that had been done none of them trust each other anymore and they all didn't like each other anymore and this guild have been apparently been together since like cataclysm so this is what's that's like what four or five years this guild have been around so I felt pretty bad it, it's funny it's fucking hilarious <laughs> that this happened because it's so stupid but it is, it's pretty bad it's pretty bad so the moral of the story is just because there's a, a, a female character with a female-ish name doesn't mean it's a, it's a girl, okay? But yeah, um, I got loads of gold out of it, and um, oh, it was at this moment he knew he fucked up. Bollocks! I think I'm fucked. See what I'm, I'm with? Oh, I can't cut either because there's oh they've all respawned. I have no potions. Come on, please be someone killing. Oh no, I think I'm actually dead here. I can't run anywhere. No, oh, come on. I actually can't run anywhere. There's mobs every. Oh, fuck my ass. Oh my god, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. Can I kill? G oh, motherfucker! Fuck off! I'm dead. I'm actually dead. I'm actually dead. Level seven. <sighs> That's embarrassing. Level seven. Maybe that's payback for breaking up a guild. Shit. I uh, I genuinely thought I could get to at least 20. To be honest, I fucked up. I fucked up. I should not have tried to get gold tooth. When, well, it's just unfortunate that all the uh, mods behind me respawned. That's really embarrassing. This is the second episode and I've died. <laughs> huh, okay. Well, uh, I don't know. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Again, I want to give a huge shout out to the sponsors of this video, Exit Lag. Exit Lag is a great piece of software to improve your gaming. It optimizes your connection to reduce ping and MS. It improves network stability and can even improve FPS with its FPS boost feature. I've been using this software for a few days now and it seems to work great. Usually in WoW I get about 40 MS on the EU servers and about 130 MS when playing on US servers, but since using exit lag I'm stable at around 20 MS here in the EU and about 70 on the US servers. It's pretty easy to set up too, all you have to do is download the program from the website, the link is in the description below, install it, open up the software, log in, search for the game you want to play, so World of Warcraft for me, choose the server you want to connect to, click optimize and finally press apply roots and boom you're done easy and like i mentioned at the start of the video there's currently an offer going on for a free day free trial so if you are a bit skeptical just give the trial a go and see if you like it